still on the road on my way to Florida. We're almost arriving in Mississippi, but before leaving Louisiana, we're gonna stop in a small town to check a world record. Got curious? Keep watching. Welcome to Mandeville. I didn't expect to find such a charming community here. Hey! <laughs> here they have the longest bridge in the world. It's in the Guinness Book. You know, officially, it's the longest continuous bridge over water in the world. Almost a 24 mile long bridge. It's crazy. It crosses an entire lake and you cannot even see the other side. Hmm, it's just disappointing to film from here. I didn't think we would be so far. And it's really, really windy today, so it might be risky to fly the drone, but it's still <laughs> really far. It wouldn't work anyways. This tree is all over town. <laughs> Look at this. This is kind of funny, you know, it could be in a horror movie. I read online that this is like a weekend destination for people from New Orleans, but wow, what a weekend destination! <laughs> Very nice. Look at these houses, how interesting. They're all built like this. There's basically nothing on the ground floor, and that's because of flooding, you know, that could happen with hurricanes, you know, like happened with Katrina. In Mandeville, they also have the largest certified southern live oak tree. What I read online is it's not clear if it's the largest in the United States or in the world, but now that I saw that tree, I'm curious if that's the species, you know? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Mississippi. <laughs> we just passed a NASA facility here. As I didn't know it was here, I didn't record. I didn't have the camera on, but there was a nice rocket in front of it. So I went online and discovered this here. That was Infinity. It's the official visitor center for NASA's Stennis Space Center. And Stennis Center is NASA's largest rocket engine test facility. How cool. Oh, let me show you something else. This is what I saw. It's a Saturn V. It's the most powerful rocket ever built. I'm crazy about NASA, guys. I love all this. Um, actually, I've seen other two Saturn V rockets, one in Houston and the other in Huntsville. The biggest rocket ever, the Saturn V. It was in one of these that men went to the moon. We're talking about the Apollo missions. Remember this in Houston. There's one over there, too. This is so gigantic. The capital of Mississippi is Jackson, which is more inland and we won't drive nearby. You know, Mississippi, despite being relatively big in size, it has about 3 million people living here in the entire state. As a comparison, all of the metropolitan area of Miami has almost twice that amount. We'll drive the entire state of Mississippi in about an hour because it's only from here to here. See, we're already halfway there. Actually, that's because just a small part of Mississippi reaches the ocean right here. All this other part here is Louisiana. And it'll be the same thing for Alabama. Look at this. Oops, here. Only this tiny part reaches the ocean. And then we already arrive in Florida, so it'll be, uh, it's probably like 30 minutes more to finish Mississippi and an hour to cross Alabama. Look at where we are now. 
close to the entrance to Gulfport and then we're gonna drive by the entrance to Biloxi and that's it we're done with Mississippi uh oh Alabama Well, remember my idea of crossing the entire states of Mississippi and Alabama in less than one hour each? Didn't work out. We got some traffic, there was an accident on the way, which ended up delaying our trip in over an hour. So we just didn't stop anymore anywhere else. We just came directly here to Panama City Beach in Florida. We'll spend the night here and tomorrow we're gonna check out this place. I heard it's beautiful. Our original idea was to sleep in Mobile. But uh, yesterday we discovered something that totally changed our plans for the better. So we drove three more hours and we're now in Panama City Beach because I really wanted to see this place. <laughs> but the fact is that this is like an hour out of our way. Um, not sure my husband realizes that because I'm the GPS and I did all the planning here and he's there right now checking us in at the hotel. I'll wait here in the car, you know, our interest might be different, but uh, it just occurred to me, he might discover when he sees this video. Oh man, I just hope that this beach is beautiful tomorrow. Oh, I didn't forget about Pensacola. We're gonna stop there on the way back. And I'm not gonna tell you what made us change our plans. <laughs> you have to watch the next vlog! <laughs> but there's a hint, actually, in this video. There was something that got me all excited on the road.